Well, the Yale Road fire now 75% contained, and while many people are feeling the relief that their home is still standing, they may not totally be out of the clear yet. Kex Y Forest Caroline Rourke is working for you, and Caroline, uh, this concern uh, is now about possible flooding. Nadine, a team from the National Weather Service in the Spokane Conservation District drove all around the Yale Road fire today to see if there were any immediate threats to homeowners in the areas. It's something that's typically, typically done after any major fire. The team checks the soil and the condition of the trees to see what kind of danger they could pose if heavy rain were to hit the area. From what they can see so far, the concern for the Yale Road fire is that if heavy rain was to wash away the trees and charred ground into surrounding creeks, the creeks could overflow, threatening homes and potentially blocking roads for emergency vehicles to pass through. In this area, the concern is probably more just people that live at the base of these steep slopes, uh, more so than the creeks, although the creek itself will be impacted with a lot of this sediment. Again, the assessment made today is preliminary, but if you live in the area, keep an eye on the weather forecast. And if there is heavy rain, be sure to be aware of your surroundings. There's some great information available to protect your home from flooding from both the Spokane Conservation District and other disaster preparedness resources. We've attached a link to those resources on our website at KXOY.com so you can check them out. Reporting in studio, Caroline Rourke, KXOY4 News.